Welcome guys to Far Cry 5 Lost on Mars, a new DLC comes out on the 17th of July and uh, yeah, I'm quite excited about it. I, I'm guessing that I'm expecting some sort of aliens, of course, uh, some new guns and hopefully a brand new map. I don't really know much about it, so I'm just excited to jump into it, see what it's about and if you guys want to see the full series on the channel, make sure you leave a like on the video, leave your comments below and let's jump in. What was that? <laughs> I did not expect that. <laughs> okay then. That slightly scared me. Perhaps we'll find uh, Matt Damon. some errands for the wife and kiddo. Cool, 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 cool. No doubt. So listen, man, remember that time a couple years back we got hammered on party liquor and spread eagle? And I made you promise that if I was ever seduced by a super hot, super intelligent being of dubious moral standing who whisked me away to an exotic land, well, that you'd come and help a brother out. Uh, vaguely. Well, bro, sis, you better buckle up because that time has arrived. Oh, shit! <laughs> I really don't have time for this. But dude, you made a promise. Do you even know what a promise is? That's like a sacred pact, man. That no hey, man shoot, man. Come on, get you stupid cow. Herc, look, can whatever you need wait till tomorrow? I'm gonna go with the big N-O on that, compadre, because this is one of them uh, life or death things that I sometimes get myself into through no fault of my own. All right, fine. I'll help. Where do you need me to go? Uh, well, it's a little far. Don't worry. I get you here in the jiffy. What the fuck does that mean? Hurt? <laughs> what the? Look, just hold on and try not to vomit. Oh, and if you got a six pack on you, go grab it now. Hurt? What the hell is going on? Oh, no, 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 situation is uh, rather dire but just head through the doors man I'll explain everything in a minute okay so we're not on Mars uh, but we're definitely not on Earth right now we are I think floating in the cosmos we are lost whoa, on Mars apparently whoa, but not just what yet systems operating so, anyway. at five percent what is this place Herc what am I doing here? Look, man, okay, there ain't always a logical explanation of these things. Sometimes you just find yourself, like, in a space station with little to no context or backstory. You just gotta fucking roll with it, man. So less questions and more movement, Nicholas, because if you don't save us, we all gonna what? die. What? Me? What the fuck are you talking about? Why Nick? <laughs> what can Nick do? I swear to God, I'm gonna whoop your ass when I see you. <laughs> Good luck. What do you mean good luck? What does that mean? I just saw a floating head. What? Her! Oh, what the? I mean... Oh man, dude! I am so happy to see you too! Now I know... Where's the rest of your body? Think. Where's my junk? But as important as the answer is to that question, we got bigger fish to fry. 
firstly, let me explain what's going on. You are now on Mars. Welcome. Now, imagine my arms are outstretched to comfort you during said revelation. Why are you on Mars? To save the Earth, man. What from? An alien invasion. Yeah, that's right, man. An alien invasion, Vigo. Now, I'm gonna keep it 100 with you. It's not gonna be us who are doing the actual saving of Earth. It's gonna be mostly Ant. That Ant. The AI super being that Larry Parker would not stop talking about, you remember? Only problem is, man, these aliens took over the entire planet. They messed with her network, man, and she has come undone. And we need to get her back, man. So how do we return Anne to this beautiful, majestic, earth-saving butterfly she once was? By finding energy cores and using them to power up all the terminals in the network, man. It's a simple plan, don't worry. Gotta get moving though, man. There's a couple energy core thingies over yonder, man. I'll show you how this works. Go get them. Energy cores? Alien invasion? What the fuck, Kirk? I didn't ask for this. Look, I'm sorry, man, okay? But you're not the only person whose life has been turned upside down for far-fetched and highly suspect reasons, okay? I mean, look at me. If anyone's a victim here, it's me, the Herkster. No, I don't want any part of this. I just want to go back to my family. That's it, man. That's the energy core. Bring it back and put it inside the terminal. So, you brought me all the way to Mars to turn the power back on? Well, don't say it like that, man. You take all the pizzazzy out of it. Control center restored. It Looks works! Like Anne's back online. Nick, this is Ann. Ann, meet my bro, Nick. Uh... Hi. Hi. Nicholas Rye, you are Earth's last hope. What? And me too, right? An arachnid force millions of years in the making threatens your world. But with your help, I can stop them. Yeah, Herc filled me in on that part. We turn on the terminals and restore your power and stop the alien invasion. Is there anything I'm missing here? No. Why do you ask? I don't know. It just seems pretty simple for something not so simple you think there'd be more to it no it is very straightforward <clears throat> okay man all systems are a go let's get down to business you're gonna need to be able to defend yourself out here you see the green barrels around here grab what's inside them the green barrels Ooh, some loot now, i know it just feels like space jizz or something but this stuff is magic Rico. Harvest is straight from the air. There's all sorts of cool shit out here. I right, so need two more. So this is like, is, is this like the currency on Mars? This weird, like, greeny, gooey stuff. When you're done, man, take some of your space jizz over that 3D print machine over there, and I'll show you a cool trick. Oh, it's a 3D printer over here. <laughs> Oh, we're about to make an alien gum. Voila, amigo. Oh, Welcome yes. Welcome to the place where all your wildest dreams come true. Current designs are limited. The more you restore me, the more blueprints I can retrieve from the database. Oh, there's loads of guns. They're all new guns. Printed. Oh, my, all my points are gone. Damn. At least I have a gun. So that's good. Uh, what's, that, what's it called? Blaster of Disaster. <laughs> Great. Got some upgrades for the suit, tribal weapons, consumables, and valuables. All right. See how that works, man? Space jizz equals firearms. Incredible. Yes. And the more my systems are restored, the more tools I can provide to obliterate any and all life forms who stand in our way. Uh, what do you mean? All life forms? Oh, you'll see when we get outside. We? Yeah, man, I ain't gonna let you hog all the glory for saving the world. This here's a partnership. Now come on, grab my head, dude. You got work to do. Grab my head. It's like God of War. Grabbing yeah. heads. This is not happening. Get a grip, Nicholas, because your brain's about to go kablooey, man. Oh, we're about to go outside. We got our actual Mars. Will help restore my functionality and help you on your journey. 
Oh, thank you very much. Uh, here's something already. Mars, you know. It's just Mars. We're on Mars. Wait, 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 man! Stay off that dirt. What? What do you mean, stay off the dirt? Whoa! Spacecraft, man! Shoot it! Shoot it, please! I'm trying to. I'm trying to. Man, defenseless. Woo! So the guns will overheat. Watch out! There's oh. war! Oh. Come on, Nick, Come on. Do it, buddy. Any more? To loot them as well. Just the green. Oh yes. A bit more currency. Any more? Want to give it a go? Can I go around the dirt? <laughs> I don't think so. Just try and run across. Ah! Fly. There we go. That seems to work. So this is the antenna. We can't find the other energy cores unless we power the antenna. Fuck me. I gotta climb towers now. Look, man. Some. <laughs> I gotta climb tires now. Um, what is He's got to now climb the antennas. Oh, Stuff wow. Stuff ain't as advanced out here as it is in Montana, for which I apologize, okay? <laughs> That's such a little... Dig it themselves. Love it. I like that. Nice. How do we actually climb them? How does that work? That just hurt a lot. How do we climb up? I mean, we can jump pretty high up, I guess. Actually, I thought my fall. days of climbing shit was over after I left Kyrat, but here we are, man. Yeah, we're still climbing. Yup! Oh, nice. Nicely done. How do we go up again? Shimmy around there? This could be tricky. I could easily fall. Man, I, I totally forgot to mention those space crabs. They live underground. That that one's on me, man. I'm, I'm so sorry. That's my bad. You're sorry? You want to tell me what that was all about? Man, ain't you ever seen Tremors? These space crab dudes, they tear through dirt the exact same way. I'm telling you, man. I hope you got a good look, man, because they're the invaders, okay? They're the ones we need to stop. Anne was telling me that they're going to use her technology to invade the Earth and turn all the humans into food. Isn't that crazy? Exactly. Humans will become nothing more than food to sustain the arachnid horde as it spreads through the galaxy. Are you sure? Because, uh, I mean, they don't look all that smart to me. Well, they are. These little bastards, they've been playing keep away with the energy cores so Anne can't get back online. So if we're gonna get those energy cores back, you can bet that these little bastards are gonna be all in our face about it. I feel very high up right now. I feel like if I fall off, I might cry. I have to do it all again. <laughs> I am worried. <laughs> Very, very worried. They don't seem very clever, but apparently they are. And they want to invade planet Earth and take us out. Do you want to try and jump up there? Is that what you're saying? Uh, this could go very, very wrong. Yes. That seemed pretty far, but we made it. It's working! Yes! First and the antenna antenna dump. restored. Functionality increased. Excellent, Nick. Thank you for your assistance. You may now consult your map to locate other energy cores in this area. Ooh. Troll sense antenna restored. Can we have a look at the map? Can we have a nosy? Oh man, those two blips right there? That looks like the spot where I was attacked by a big ass space crab. I am picking up a signal from your gravity belt nearby. It will improve mobility, remove fall damage, and allow you to reach the transference center. No. No way, my space jets are still working, dude! Dude, my space jets are still working! Okay, let's go find them, man. You sure? Is that the next mission? All right, energy corridor as well. Dismembered. Find and collect the energy cores, guys. We have an objective. Once you acquire the gravity belt. Go. go to the transference center. What the hell's transference? Transference is the future. 
It's plugging my consciousness into a robot killing machine like I'm at 209. Transference is the future. Yeah, yeah, we get it, and Oh, man, she's been trying to make me forget about finding my human body, so I'll just live life in a robot body. But I got a good feeling, man. I'm staying positive. For obvious reasons, he wants to find his human body, which we completely understand. He doesn't want to be a headless human for too long. So we do have space bandages as well. Ow. Let's be careful here. I don't want to... Uh, Give myself too much damage. So we're going that way, are we? Don't mind me. Floating on Mars. Yep, that's exactly what I'm doing right now. I love when Ubisoft just does like random DLC. Like, this is obviously uh, nothing like the full game. It's completely different. We had Vietnam, and now we're on Mars. It's just a tiny bit insane. But I love it. This That's what DLC should be lock. like. Please wait. Ooh. Whose body's oh, that? Dang, is that? Is that my hand? I think it what? might be. Who else's hand would it be, dummy? Wow, we found a hand. Fair point, man. I'm just not mentally prepared to accept the possibility that something really bad has happened to my childless dad bod. So is that uh, is that the collectible in this game? <laughs> Herc's body parts. My scans indicate wow. several more organic anomalies. Oh, come on, are you serious? My body's in a bunch of pieces? Correct. Oh, man, how are we going to find them all? With transference, you will gain the ability to detect such anomalies yourself. Uh, how do we, I thought we go through this door, done but... and done. Apparently not. Here and now, another promise is made. We will find my body parts and put me back together like Humpty Dumpty, because there ain't no <laughs> point in saving a world that does not include my beautiful booty. Unhappy, you will comply. Transference is the future. Okay, just like Ann said, we need to find the space jets I was using. Can't get to the transference center without them. Uh, walk around the ground is safe as long as there is uh, no sand. Okay, so look for rocky terrain when navigating. Stepping on brown sand will attract the arachnids, the aliens. Arachnids generate ground tremors as they travel beneath the earth, uh, making them easy to spot. Okay. Oh, yeah, I can see them. Okay, that's Watch cool. your step, man, and remember, the sand is bad. The sand is very, very bad. See them. Should I land on the rock? Oh. The sand is evil. Damn! Looks like the energy cores are up there. We need to find those space jets. Uh oh. Ooh, well, screw that up. It's all good. It's all good. I can float. I can float. I love the lack of gravity. How do we get up there? Very good question, Mr. Scott. Oh I... shit, that's my pelvic area! Oh. Big ass space crab did me dirt! How did you literally scup into so many body parts? What did you do? Oh, that's his penis and his butt. Lovely. Right, so what's this? The gravity pelt gives you better mobility. Ooh, so press X to activate it. And hold circle to descend rapidly. Um, one in the air. Tap circle to hover. This will greatly reduce the energy it consumes. Okay, with the gravity pelt you now immune to full damage. Oh, sweet. That's cool, that's cool, that's cool. Got another Wait. space bandage. Where's my chunk? Nick! Nick! Where's my junk? Nick, you are lucky you've never had to go through this, man. Nick, I'm telling you, there is no worse feeling than thinking you found your dismembered member only to realize it's your peckerless pelvis. Come on, man. A little sympathy. Right. Can we make it up there without running out of energy? We are about to find out. Please. And there we go. Oh, yes. Nicely done. Woo! I can make that as well. <laughs> That's far. That's very, very far. We gotta find the rest of me, Nick. From my temples to my taint to my toes, man. All of me, okay? And then Anne can turn me into a real boy again. Herc, a real boy. What you're saying isn't possible. No way, Jose. You shoot a big enough load of that space jizz in the Anne's 3D printer, and anything is possible. 
Nonsense, Herc. With transference, you'll become something greater than man. Oh. You will become immortal. Indestructible. You will be perfect. Wow. wow, there is truth to that statement. I gotta be honest with you, I am on the temporary train for this one, Anne. I don't expect you to understand the joys of humanity, the pleasures of the flesh, the delights of the senses, the takings of a monstrous dump. Uh, there's a lot of arachnids around, and they're not underground, which is a slight concern. I'm not going to lie. Is this one going to attack me? Oh, there's two. Listen, man, I get it. You're mm. afraid if I become a robot, I'll try to kill you, but I promise I won't. I'm gonna be a good. Okay then. Uh, shoot the exposed red flesh on its back. We inflict maximum damage. Okay. Robot like RTD2, but with a machine gun. Uh, I'll do coming around now. Oh, this is bad. And they shoot as well. What is this? Bad. Very, very bad. Oh, this is bad, bad, bad. Look, I can do some help right now. Bandaged up. Face. Bandages. Loot your Come body. On, man. You want me to be a cyber killing machine and fulfill Sell my it. destiny or not? It's gonna steal one coming. Yep. I get this little red fleshy bits. Yeah! Can we really do a better gun right now? I'm not gonna lie. This is not the best gun in the world. Or a mask. <laughs> oh. Ah! Where's it? So many around here. Right, look at the map. Are we clear? We're clear. Let's loot you. Let's head down here. I did see. Yeah, like a little container chest thingy. Quit toiling my emotions, man. It is the only thing I have left. Now let's get to the transference center. Oh, you can float for ages. Love it. Well, have an objective. We must do it. Man, Mars is scary. I don't want to go to Mars. This is what it's like. No, no, no. Not about that life. Does that count as sand? <laughs> I'm not seeing any tremors, so. So when can, do we have to go back to our base to buy a new gun? I think you probably have to. Yeah, probably. I'm guessing we can we can fast travel. Okay. Well, I've only got around 366, and she's got to become more powerful to unlock new guns and stuff like that. So. That's his Approaching true. transference center. Yep, I see oh, that. Oh man, I'm starting to get real excited now. I cannot believe that in just a few minutes I'm going to be a cold, uncaring, cybernetic death monster. It's going to be sweet, man. It's going to be sweet. <laughs> Such a random character. You've been in Far Cry for so long, though. We have arrived. Not quite sure what's going on. Ooh, a space bandage. Oh no. Oh no. I realize this is here. Oh, there is. There's loads. Woo! Sort of. For what? That's the same weapon. I don't have any other weapons yet. Cheeky game. I'm trying to tease me. I think we're supposed to go up a floor. If we can. Space bandages. Oh, yeah, we did not want to go into that sand right now. No, no, no. Oh, hello. I missed you. Let's see, it's not much, but it all counts. Can we get onto the next floor? I can give it a go. Yes, we can. Nice. I think that's inside, isn't it? Hmm. Try to up again. I'm not sure that's working out. That's a beam of death. You don't want to touch that. Right, so this... I guess we can sort of tell roughly where we need to go. So we 
to go sort of in there. Okay, we can do that. Am I the only one really enjoying this so far? Like, I really, really like it. <laughs> ooh, ooh. We're in. Okay, the terminal is on the top floor. You gotta power that place up before we can use the transference chamber. You fly like the wind now, little monkey. Monkeys don't fly, Herc. Not with that attitude, they don't. Transference center restored. You can now use the transference chamber. The two of you working as a team will greatly increase our chances of success. Team Tad Bros for life. Put me in, dude. Put me in. Are you sure? <laughs> Are you sure about this? I'm not so sure. So got to avoid the sand. Do I head straight away all the way across? Can we make it? There's a few uh, trimmers in there. At least I'm counting three at least. Let's do it. I trust power of my jetpack. There we go. Done. Put the head in. Oh. Look out, man! Big ass spacecraft! Oh no. I've only got a pistol for Christ's sake. That's her. God. That's her. That is a spacecraft what stole my privates, man. I know. I'd recognize that ugly face anywhere. You're the reason my wiener's rolling around the sand somewhere I looking like a gigantic breaded chicken cutlet. I don't seem to have any ammo right now. I've got nothing left. Really? Overheating? I don't know. Yes. One's yes. gone. Oh my goodness. You Woo. did it, man. You did it. You Stop firing. And my wiener. That's brotherly love, man. Woo. Now right, put me go. in for real, and don't forget Quite to take my as well as I hope. We'll need it to complete the awkward human puzzle I've become. They're running away. They're scared of me. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I need to go back and get a new weapon. This is not working out right now. It was like, switch weapon? I didn't have, didn't have a new weapon. I, I was just waiting for it to sort of replenish. Channel now. Don't mess up my goatee. So what does this do? What I am fucking Robocop, man. Half man, <laughs> what is half that? robot, all party machine. Oh my god, I need some theme music. Oh my god. Robots. Available for hire. <laughs> what the hell? Uh, robot can't die. Wow. But he can be injured the point of malfunction. To revive him, um, hold down square. So he's called the robot. Very nice. So he has joined my, rot my roster. Very cool. Right, should we do a bit of looting while we're here? Yes, we should. And then we can... Uh... All right, man. You, you still got an energy core? Let's head to the closest antenna. Or we could do that. I mean, I think I want a new gun first. I really want a new gun. Head back. Give me two seconds though to loot. Oh, someone just saw me. Yep. Let's see what a robot's about. What was that gun? Attack! Woo! Teamwork! Okay, I can see at least three coming this way. That's not good. Have I looted those already? I don't think I have a sort of flash. Double check. Oh yeah. Not much, but like I said, it all adds up. Where's Probot? Is he around? He better be. Three coming this way. Oh damn. Nice. Oh, he's back up again. Exploded. Whoops. Oh, nice. Lots of supplies. Still several outside. Oh, coming in. That one. Yeah, I see it. yeah, that one. Let's go for that one, please. On the ground. It's weak town. Dead and over. No. They are Kill dead it. Is dead. Here's weak spot. 
I count two. Where have you gone? What are you shooting at? What are you shooting at? I got no idea. Uh, Brobat, a Brobot can be commanded. Yes, we've right, been doing buddy. that already. Brace yourself, you're about to pop a bro boner here. Check it out. Your bad boy Brobocop here is fitted with a whole punch and lasers that these spacecraft don't stand no chance against. And this section oh! of the body was built to last all kinds of physical and verbal abuse. Wow. We're linked up, man, so you can just tell me where to go and I'll follow, man. I won't even argue like ever. Unless you say something about monkeys. And if we find ourselves in a pickle and shit gets real intense, you just use me, man. I'll draw these suckers away with my jaw-dropping dance moves and such. Now, I know you're impressed with how impressive I've become, but don't let how impressive I am distract you from the <laughs> fact that we gotta give our human compadres the heroes they deserve. We need Coming to find in. more energy cores, Fight man. Me. I think there's another antenna nearby, so let's go. There it is. <laughs> Just fly. How the hell did you get mixed up in all this? Oh, what is important is that you understand how much danger we're all in because I didn't, okay? I fucked up. I, I, I didn't really realize. <laughs> I tried to impress Anne by taking care of this all myself and where to get me? Got my damn body snatched and sprinkled all over damn Mars. It's probably my fault for telling her that I was Earth's greatest champion. I see that now, but come on, man. I was, I was trying to get some. So all I'm trying to tell you, Nick, is that you can't be a dummy about this, okay? You can't be thinking you're some new hot kid on the block. You gotta stay humble, man. Stay focused. You gotta be smart, man, like old Herc. Do you hear yourself? I'm stuck doing this because you're not smart. You're actually really, really dumb, Herc. I was dumb, Nick. I was dumb. Oh, Past shit. Tense, and for like a very short period of time, I'm talking 17 seconds max. And that's way less time than most people spend being dumb, which is a scientific fact. Which means that it is scientifically impossible for me to do anything dumb for like a long, long time, man. Like statistically, that's a fact. Right? 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 Nick? Getting seriously heated right now. Woo! A very good strategy. So many. Fly above them. Oh no. Please just give me a weapon to use. Stop overheating. Oh, this is very, very bad. This is very, very bad. I didn't realize how many aliens are over the hill. Okay. I'm going! Right, doing well. Nice. Elliot, please. We killed so many. We have so much loot. Can we I'm gonna fast travel. Yeah, we're gonna fast travel. That sounds like a very, very good idea right now. So that's where the new antenna is. I would like to go back to the control center and get some new stuff, basically. Get some new weapons, some new upgrades because we need it, otherwise we will die a very painful death. I got, I still got a basic pistol. It's not that great in terms of stats. It's just be good to have another option, really. 3D printer, yeah. Do we have any suit upgrades? Got some costume rules. I mean, I would like, ooh, buff yourself with space armor. I like that. Also some bandages would be good. But ideally, I want weapons right now. Give me sweet, sweet weapons. Is that a slightly different gun? Accuracy 10. Impressive. I want the rifle. Yeah, I need the rifle in my life. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. V punches in bunches. Very nice. Uh, and then some bandages. And some armor. Please. Guys, that is the next antenna. I've got a new gun. I'm not afraid to use it. <laughs> that looks harder to climb, though. That looks, uh... Very tricky. And most likely, probably guarded as well. Yay. At least I've got a companion now, which will actually fight back. That's always... That's true. Approaching antenna. All right. What is that? Electro-grenades. This grenade will unleash a powerful electric blast. 
Use it to briefly paralyze and inflict damage on multiple aliens. <laughs> and same deal as last time. Get to the top and power that terminal. Arachnids, but I like to call them aliens. Invisibility cloak acquired. What? Excuse me? We can now disappear. Uh, use a disappearing act to temporarily avoid being detected uh, by the arachnids. There are two ways to activate it. Uh, use the weapon wheel or use the D-pad. Okay. I need right now, do I? I hope not. Harvest arachnid pulp by interacting with the queen eggs. The queen? Is there a queen here? That's like a final boss, perhaps. Arachnid pulp can be thrown at the arachnids just like a grenade. Uh, affected arachnids will become um, will become the attack target. Ah, okay, cool. So I read that completely wrong, by the way. The first time I read that was... Yeah. Oh, there's the, uh, there's the eggs. Okay, interesting. Very interesting. Hey, this looks kind of fun. Looks kind of deadly to me. Uh -oh. oh, just embrace oh, no. it, man. See, there's a chance to test yourself. And to test those space jets. Come on, man. Beware the stabilizer cores. Touching them will cause severe harm to any organic matter. Oh, great. Sucks for you, buddy, that you're made out of all that organicness. Too bad you don't have a sweet killer robot outfit like I do. Transference is the future. Robots never age, never decay, never rot. Robots are forever. Do you wow. desire transference, Nekrai? No. Uh, no. It's okay, I'm good. I'm good, thank you. Ooh, just about made that. Ooh, I don't like those sort of jumps. Well, it's the next one. I guess it's this platform right here, but I can't hit that. If we get too close to it, it will wipe us out. Grab some of them eggs, man. Their crab moans will come in handy. So what exactly is going to happen once Anne's power is restored? Woo. As you restore power to my terminals, you will in turn help me regain control of my network. My robot army will power back on and assist you in fending off the arachnid horde. Robot army? Wait, ah. robot army? Once I regain full control, I will direct my robots to the launcher, where they will travel to Earth and intercept the arachnid invasion. Oh. I know, man. It's going to be awesome. Her. That sounds terrifying. I do not want to restart this right now and do it all again. <laughs> oh, these antennas are back. Still got quite a long way to go as well. You get to like, the right height and then press. Oh no, wrong button. Oh no. Should have just tapped it. I held it for too long. Circle that is. Where to next? I could try and just try and go above. There's no really point going up. Is there any point going over to there? Would that give me a slightly better angle, I guess? It's quite a long way, though. Will I just try and go up? Yes, just go up. <laughs> that saved me some time. That's the last and final jump, though. It looks... Uh, Hard. But this is the highest platform, isn't it? There's no other way to do it. Hmm. I'll try and jump on this bit. A slight better edge. That's really high up. This is definitely the best approach. Yep. Okay. Whoa, hey, we did it. We did it, we did it, we did it. Antenna. Whoa, okay, hang on, man. I got all kinds of shit flashing up in my eyes here. What the hell is this? I've uploaded the locations of your body parts to your map. Ah. We can unlock him straight away. Nice. Antenna C1 restored. Energy core locations updated. A new weapon. That looks like a grenade of some sort, Sweet. some sort of explosive. I'm picking up a reading now. Near that energy core. Let's check it out, man. No stone left unturned, know what I mean? I gotta say, Ann, I'm touched. Because I know you're not super on board with the idea of me being human again. I have had enough discussions with you, Herc, to know that appealing to you with logic and reason is pointless. 
Oh, man. That is really nice of you to say. You really get me. Herc, shouldn't we be focusing on saving the world? Nick Rye is correct. We are. I just want to take a peek, okay? Right, guys. That will conclude this episode. I had so much fun playing this. It's a lot better than I expected. Really, really fun. Hope you guys enjoyed it as well. Leave a like if you guys want to see a full series on the channel ASAP. There's a few missions I can't show you, but I've not reached them yet, so that's good. Um, yeah, I'm excited to play more. I'll see you guys soon. Bye-bye.